I went outside this morning to take a little wee-wee. I got them freeze-ons, dude. I said, huh, finally time to do chili. Let's get it, dude. Chili is even worse than gumbo. There is so many keyboard chili experts out there. It's crazy. Cook the chili how you like. I hit mine with the Holy Trinity. Listen to the sizzle. Now, I do four meat, three different kind of ways. I got that ground deer meat. I got some beef ground up, and I got some back scraps cubed up. Put that in there. Also, I got some wild pork breakfast sausage. You can probably use store-bought sausage, come out the same. Now, while all that meat and them holy trinity is starting to like each other, they're starting to, look at them, they're hanging out, they're all grouped together. We hit that with a little ground cumin, cumin seed. Who would name your seed a cumin? Probably a cuyon. Season that up. Oh. And it's time for that old, make sure we get that good. Make sure it's time for the old two-step, boy. This has been pretty good to me. It's been pretty good. Now, we're going to mix that all together. Let that cook now. Cumin seed, cumin seed. Somebody planted their cumin seeds. Okay. Now, we're cooking this for the Halloween party, and you know I'm going to hit it with that ghost pepper, dude. A lot of it. We're going to scare some people. Got that <laughs> smothering down. It's bubbling. It's doubling. It's doing its thing. And look, check out these new Cajun two-step cones, dude. While we wait, we hydrate. All right, you got that browning down? You add that tomato paste. Boom. Then you got that rotel. Boom. Then right here, you got that chili powder. We're going to add this, but we're going to keep tasting, and we're going to keep adding chili powder to it's like I like. Well, my wife's going to be mad now. I done broke everything. Look, she even got me these little wooden spoons because I keep breaking all her good stuff. Get out of here. God, it's all shits and giggles until somebody giggles and shit, dude. I'm in trouble. Breaking everything. All right, next we're going to hit it with them beans. Yeah, I put them beans in my chili. Oh, no, he put beans. Then we talked about you cook your chili how you want. I'm going to cook my chili with beans, dude. Let that cook down. Oh, make sure you hit it with a lot of that fresh parsley. It's going to be beautiful. Hey, you can actually put chili on a cracker, dude. That's what they tell me. Or oh, hot dog. Or oh, some Frito pies. Or some nachos and chili. So much you could do with this. I just don't put it on rice. But you could do that. But I learned y'all how I eat that chili, dude. I get that. I put all that good chili in there like that. Do a little plate. Some jalapenos and cheese. Put that in there like that. Huh, let me see. I mix that around. I'll melt that old cheese up. Now I put them jalapenos in there. I put some cheese. I got that chili. I line that in crackers. Then I get that cracker from that cracker assistant. Whew. Look at that. Mm -mm. Y'all know what I'm going to say because y'all know this is money, dude. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Sounds like bomb, boy. I'm going to just keep eating. That's a hog, bro. Mmm. -hmm. I'm about to go make me a hot dog, dude. That's money.